Hello and welcome back. This is going to be one of the quickest videos I shall ever do. It's um, Stones Parts to Wash and there are literally uh, two chords in it. There is a G chord in the open position and a B flat played there. Okay, so main riff. Okay, easy enough. G chord. You're not fretting the B uh, on the A string. What you're going to play, and you can kind of break this into two parts. So there's the uh, the bass part, if you like, which just goes. So there's a while he's playing the chord, he's sliding his first finger up to the second fret like this. It's quite a lazy slide, so it's a bit of a. So the rhythm of the bass is and the rhythm of the accompanying chords, which are basically the top four notes of the G chord, goes like this. So you can see from my right hand it's very, very loose. Slow that right down. Okay, so it's just that bit. Once you hit the G, you're abandoning the A um, note completely. You're not you're not staying on the second um, on the B like you would do with a normal G chord. Um, you can, but I see him taking that off when he's playing live and it kind of feels natural to do that anyway. Um, feels like a bit of a stretch at first as well because that's quite difficult unless you have humongous hands, uh, which I don't, so. Let me show you a close up of the main riff. Okay, so you go around that a load of times. Um, the verse is played exactly like that too. Then in the chorus, um, this isn't a difficult riff, it just goes like this. So you're going from the B chord to the G. The only thing strange about it is the phrasing the way it comes in. It's all in 4-4, there's no weird extra beats or anything, uh, but there it, it comes in on the second uh, eighth note or quaver. So if you count one, two, three, four, one. One, two. And you're back into that. So after the first Chorus, um, there's a little drum fill, and there is a bar of two four in there, so watch out for that. Then you're back into the normal riff, and away you go. I think it then goes verse, chorus, and then cuts out for a bit, and then he comes back in with the. He plays that to the end. That's it, that's the song in a nutshell. But I'll focus on this um, chorus riff for a little bit longer. Um, and played slowly, it is. One, two, three, four, one.
and then a close up of the chorus. That is it, wash in a nutshell. So I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you on the next one. Ta-da!